yeah let's have a look at uh, of course the gun the different abilities there's also a passive ability that i think a lot of people might actually miss at first so yeah it is a three difficulty hero as well rated as a difficult hero uh, the three out of three rating i don't think anyone really cares about that rating but it is there and available in overwatch as well just nobody really ever looks at it but yeah uh, of course baptiste is a support here he is ready to go oh man very much ready to go this launcher is the biotic launcher and uh, it is a three round burst biotic launcher that rewards accuracy and recoil control with significant damage output it also doubles as a healing device lobbing projectiles that heal near the point of impact so this is what this screen looks like you got the three round burst gun on the left mouse button there and right mouse button is a lobby healing projectile that heals all allies near the impact so pretty much kind of what i was speculating uh for it to be honestly so we got Oh, three bursts like, like this. It's kind of not really what I expected, but okay. Okay, well, it's it's kind of what I expected, I guess. Uh, that's very interesting. We don't. Do we have any guns that really work like this? I don't really think so. It feels pretty good, though. I mean, rewards accuracy. It's a little bit of like recoil compensation. It's honestly pretty easy to shoot with, but a lot of people don't like burst guns. It seems like the fall off is quite extreme as well. Uh, so we'll have a look at that. And the right click, of course, to heal the allies. We're just gonna. Go through it all very systematically, like this. And I mean, that's available fairly often. You got uh, the 10 out of 10 shots in the bottom right there, as you can see. So, yeah. It's pretty good. Uh, so, let's see, how much does that actually heal for? So, oh, that's actually quite a bit. Let's look at this guy. So, it's about. Okay. I mean, is that about 50? About 40? It's kind of hard to tell. I'm sure someone's gonna do the exact numbers check in not too long, but yeah, that's how the gun works. Now, I want to show the passive right now because it's really cool. So if you crouch first, you can actually jump higher afterwards, which is really sick. I really like the idea of this. You got the little charge up and you can actually reach quite high up. But yeah, the charge up is also good just so you can see uh, quite how long you need to be crouched for. But it is obvious, you know, you got the audio cue as well. So yeah, really liking that. Just great for a support to have these uh, types of uh, this type of mobility as well you know imagine a Sinyata with a movement ability too uh, just yeah really good stuff all right next up we have the regenerative burst uh, which is uh, well this little thing right here that's uh, just an AOE heal over time sort of thing Baptist activates an intense regenerative burst that heals himself and nearby allies over time so again kind of hard to see exactly for how much for I'm just gonna keep this bot alive so I can actually roughly check so we start this obviously it's getting shot as well but yeah it's a pretty slow heal over time but that seems to be of like about a hundred I guess maybe a little bit more in. either way um, we got the next ability which is a pretty good one watch this this is the immortality field. It's kind of like a more like the immortality tin can or the immortality cylinder, but yeah, uh, your allies cannot die when they are in this. Obviously, they can go all the way down to one HP, but Baptiste uses a device to create a field that prevents allies from dying. So yeah, and the generator, this thing can be destroyed. I can't see its health bar, uh, so kind of hard to know how good that is but it shows also i guess the minimum amount of hp there so that seems uh that seems pretty useful but yeah this is really good for like long range fights i guess you could say like uh, two widowmakers fighting each other one of them has an immortality field can just peak for ages uh that might be good just speculating all right next one we have of course the ultimate the amplification matrix baptiste creates a matrix that doubles the damage and healing effects uh, of friendly projectiles that pass through it so I assume if I just do this yeah that's a big burst it's really interesting all right I want to see how big that is as well because that just seemed to be a fairly small box but yeah I uh, can't really you know try it out properly myself other than shooting through it myself you know can't have allies do it in the, tra in the practice range but pretty interesting I'll uh, make sure I get another open real quick so the main thing I guess the main takeaway is that the gun is burst that's the it's just like a, an AR burst. I think a lot of people, including myself, was expecting the gun as well to also use kind of projectiles like this. I can't help but notice that the projectiles, if you look on the gun right now on the screen, are yellow in the capsules there. When on all of the other stuff we saw, the projectiles were actually green. Uh, which is what led a lot of people to believe that there was some sort of poison uh, going on. And that, uh, yeah, it would be a... Like Jeff said, I think a while ago, green is safe for poison or whatever. 
Alright, anyway, uh, let's see how big this thing actually is. So, I mean, it's not that big. <laughs> but I guess I can do this. That's very interesting. Um, yeah, I, I, I really like the idea of that. I guess that leaves you to be able to actually play at quite quite a lot of uh, range. The one change of that being the uh, the a the close AOE heal. But other than that, you quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of range. You can throw this up pretty far as well. All right. Anyway, that's it. That's a quick look at the Baptiste abilities, and uh, we're gonna be having an interactions video, up, of course, and all of that good stuff in not too long. So keep an eye on the channel for that. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Until next time, take care, and I'll see you then.